Hey folks, how's it going? My name is Gabe. I'm here with Southwest Florida Auto and today I'm going to be showing this 2002 Jeep Grand Cherokee Laredo. Um, it's uh, kind of a charcoal gray in color. Really an awesome look. This vehicle the paint job looks really nice. Um, not all faded. Still got plenty of shine left to it as you can see. It's sparkling there in the shun sun. Excuse me. <clears throat> Um, and I'm really just going to do a quick walk around video here today, kind of go over some of the features of the vehicle, um, show you the ins and outs. Uh, starting here in the front, the headlights are crystal clear, all right, everything looking good, fully intact, fully functioning, the bumper in place, never been tampered with, anything of that matter. As you can see, everything shuts nice and snug, fits nice and snug, all right, moving on now to this side of the vehicle. Uh, still has all four matching Jeep rims, not all curved up, looking good. All right, tires have a decent amount of tread life left. All the side paneling and everything still fully intact. Okay, this vehicle does have a uh, sunroof there. The rear here, the tail lights looking good. All right, go ahead and open the rear hatch for you. Very clean interior in this vehicle. All the leather seats and everything in great shape. As you can see here, the carpet as clean as could be. Uh, it does have this little divider deal here that snaps right into place. If I can get it to go. There we go. Got two little levels there. All right, the headliner looking good. No spare tire, unfortunately. This side of the vehicle, very clean as well. The exception of maybe a few minor dings and dents here and there. I don't know if you can see that or not. But um, other than that, really, really clean. Okay. Moving on out of the interior. As I said before, the leather seats in fantastic shape. All right, all the door panels fully intact, not all worn out from people getting in and out of the car. Okay, and it does have this, uh, I don't know, I guess vinyl type covering over the carpet there in the back. Okay. Driver's side door panel, very clean. All the paint is still on all the buttons, as you can see. Not all worn out. The driver's seat in tip top shape. Okay. Go ahead and start her up for you. You can see all the lights come on. So start it. Absolutely no lights on in the dash. You can see the mileage there. 125,000 miles. That's nothing on these Jeeps. Uh, they'll run forever. Rev her up for you. Revs up nice and smooth. Okay, no issues. The radio does work. Has a pretty nice sound system in this vehicle. It's got this little aftermarket radio. Pretty cool radio. It's got the auxiliary port. And plug your phone in. The AC does blow ice cold. Everything works. All the knobs work and everything that matter. Okay. Goes into gear. Very smooth. No resistance at all. Okay. Go ahead and throw her into uh, four wheel drive for you. Gotta put it in neutral. Four wheel drive part time. Full time. Nope. Excuse me. Get it to go now. Is in a four wheel drive low. Oh, it does have a neutral in the transfer case, so in case you needed to haul it um, behind a camper or something of that matter, you're able to do so. All right. Go ahead and pop the hood for you. Show you what's going on under there.
all the belts operating just as they should. Uh, very clean engine. Idles nice and smooth. Okay. Everything looking good, operating as it should. All right. So as you can see, uh, this vehicle is very clean. Obviously been maintained very well. Um, and these Jeeps are very reliable vehicles. Um, she's ready to provide you with a reliable means of transportation for years to come. Thank you for watching this video today. I hope it was of some assistance to you. There should be uh, some contact information and where the vehicle is located there on the page. Thanks again.